or do we have to deconstruct it? I think we just have to deconstruct it, which we'll do in the morning. Too bad, um, I think you can get, uh, duplicants that work during the night. So they sleep during, like, the day or whatever, and then during the night, they'll be up and busy. They don't sleep for the whole day, because that'd be ridiculous. Look at, look at the day up here, and the all that white bits, daytime, and that little, little section is nighttime. I think so anyway. I know that in RimWorld they do that, which is fun. <laughs> Sanitizing it? Disinfecting. There we go. What's going on? Plumbing, outhouse, right there. Ooh, it makes poop. That's gonna be annoying. Methane, I assume. Can we see? Polluted oxygen. Oh. Okay. You know what that means? That means cancel that. Cancel that. Build a tile. Here and here. Because I want a door. It won't really work. Because it's not sealed. But at the very least. I want it to try to... And then we want plumbing. We want the outhouse to be there. And the... Is this big enough? Yep. That's what we want. <laughs> oh no, all that sand is, um... Priority 6. Oh, they're communicating. I guess it doesn't matter. They're going to have to clear it out anyway. Oh, he's going to fall. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. Oh, do we have enough copper? Yeah, it's still copper down there. I guess they just haven't gotten to it yet. We can actually prioritize it. And they should get to doing it. Yep, they're picking up the copper. And they're going to do it. That's awesome. So this needs the water. We don't have access to water yet, the water's down here, but we want to be 100% safe in getting this water, which also means we'll collect all this. Before we do it, we need to watch out for sand, we need everything to be perfectly safe. Let's, um, yeah, let's, I don't know what, how to approach this, I guess we'll see if that works. Then I'll place a door here. We'll place two tiles here. And then we'll dig. Mm. Up here. Here. And then, yeah. See how this works. Let's build a ladder here. So my plan is, we don't want this polluted. So if liquid falls, flows down, hopefully it at least will get caught. Um, we actually, we want to make this like huge priority. And we want to build this right here, I reckon. Up in here. Is he gonna pop off? Nope, it goes up. Okay, I feel a lot better now. <laughs> and these batteries are full. This needs meal ice and other stuff. Let's give it a priority six as well. So they should focus on making food before all other stuff, is what I'm thinking. And same with this, honestly. We need to keep people safe. Can we do this? 
I wonder. I mean, yeah, surely they can walk through the ladders, or like past them. Also, I totally decided to stop the whole uh, 10 minute timer thing. I think I'll just chop up the videos to be around about 10 minutes. Unless something exciting happens, we'll keep it going a bit longer. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. I just discovered something else we want to do. Do this. Deconstruct this. Actually, that no, doesn't really matter. I can just uh, place the thing I want. I want this, and I want it to be priority 9. Come on, come on. Because there is poo poo in these, <laughs> which we do not want at all. We want this built pronto. We want to set it to priority 9. We want all the polluted stuff to go in here. Um, organic polluted dirt, priority 9. Yep, they're going to take it out, please? Yep, okay. So now all the polluted stuff will stay in here. And we can even dig up this. Once we reach there. Which will probably be up here. In fact, here. What we can do is set up um, this. For when they get the chance. Okay. We've got this. We want to priority the picking up of... Wait. Move to bring it to storage. Priority 9. This stuff. There we go. Okay. Um, waiting for materials. Waiting for water. So I don't think we have water. So I think it's good to go for this. Muckroot. Unreachable. I think that mealworm thing that we had, I might have destroyed. Yeah. Well, this is harvest ready. This buried muckroot. Enable auto harvest. I just don't want all this stuff dropping in the bottom. This sandstone will probably drop in, but. I'm not too fussed about that. Plumbing. Pitcher pump. Manually pumps liquids into bottles. Okay. Yeah, there's a lot I don't know. Um, let's actually also priority 9 this. Just this. Or actually, cancel. I don't know, I want this to live. If at all possible. Yeah, so there's no oxygen down here. So I, I might have been wrong. Carbon dioxide might <laughs> go down to the ground. Which I guess it does make sense. The thing I was thinking, I was thinking it, it's heat so it rises. You know what I mean? But I guess that's not necessarily heat. And, and it makes sense that it would drop in the aspect of, of plants and stuff, right? Because plants eat the carbon dioxide and poop out the oxygen, yeah? But then at the same time, like, I don't know. I, don't, I genuinely I don't know enough. I'm too dumb. I thought, it ro I thought it rose. And yet it looks like it's all sitting at the bottom. He's up and awake. What's he gonna do? Let's watch him. He doesn't know what he's doing. Oh, he's growing old. And then he'll die. Egg chances. How do I get him to lay an egg? The ideal temperatures. Diet. Oh, where's he going? Is he just walking over there? Yep. What does Wrangle do? K. 
capture this critter alive. There has to be a way to... We'll probably unlock it, I reckon. We must unlock the ability to farm them. Okay, let's, let's fast forward through the night.